There's a new butcher shop on Buffalo's west side, but their specialty is actually doing things the good old fashioned way. It's all about using local meat and more of the animal. Our Mike Randall sunk his teeth into this one. He has the hands of a surgeon and the heart of an artist. To watch Tom Moriarty work is to see someone who truly enjoys what he does. I didn't really understand what it meant until I saw him in action. Moriarty Meats focuses on whole animal butchery. The shop is a dream come true for Tom and his wife, Caitlin. It's a passion project for us. So we, uh, you know, we just do it on Fridays and Saturdays. Tom says the shop is just a hobby. It's kind of been this weird, evolving career path. I wouldn't even call it a career path. He spent a year and a half training in France to learn the trade and now hopes to recreate the old world butcher shop still found in Europe. There's a certain uh, romanticism about it that is just really neat that we don't have here. Most of the meat is locally raised. This is from a farm um, up in Walcott. They break down only one animal a week. So this week is beef, um, last week we did pork. And they use as much as 95% of the animal coming up with European style cuts. And it's called, in France, La Persillée. And the reason it's called that was because of the marbling through there. But you won't get this cut anyplace else. No, town, absolutely right? not. Sometimes he'll do special orders. Tom's friend asked for extra large tomahawk steaks. So now, Aaron, if you're out there watching this, here are your big steaks to make a big splash. Caitlin and Tom plan to keep their day jobs. The day job is what pays the bills right now. But you'll find them here Saturdays 10 to 5. See, it really is a hobby. Practicing an old world artistry that puts them a cut above the rest. For the Nile Buffalo, I'm Mike Randall. How about this?